Greetings and salutations, my name is JW6W8, and today I am playing Star Maid, and we are back on the rail mine. And, um, yesterday I was, uh, complaining that, uh, this is not working right, the, the rail is not moving the way it should, and I couldn't figure out why, because all the logic's set up, and, um, I imagine that, uh, you're probably shouting at the screen and probably left nasty comments saying, Hey, stupid, here's the reason why. Because when I hopped out of the ship, I saw, Oh, there's the reason why. Hey, stupid, reactor uses is at 4,000%, so your mass rail enhancers aren't doing anything. How is my reactor at 4,000% anyway? All right, so let's actually put a reactor on this instead of the uh, the fake reactor I was using. Fake reactor. Well, I mean the the simple what ten block reactor. Of course, I don't want this to be in the way of anything. So, how are we gonna do this? Well, first of all, we're gonna replace that with this. And let's see. It's a one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Three, four, five, four, five. All right. So let's do a five by five by ten by ten. There we go. And let's obliterate this reactor. And all these thrusters, let's actually move the thrusters somewhere useful. All right. Let's see, let's do something like that. There we go. Except now we're going to need stabilization. And we can't put stabilization just anywhere. Well, we can't just put it anywhere, but that's not a good idea. So let's... Let's do something like a 5 by 5 by 10. Let's mount it over here. No dummy. 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10. There we go. Now my usage is at a whole bunch. 16%. Now let's turn that off. Go away. Now we are moving smoothly at half speed, which is what we needed. All right. So now that I've learned that I am not a moron, so we hit the button so that should... Go away. Now there we go. That should set everything to return. You are not returning. You are now, though. Huh. All right. So now let's set up our loading and unloading logic. So. What do we need to do? We need an unload rail. Unload rail. Box going out. It needs to be facing this way up. All right. This way up. All right. So that's good. We're going to try to cram all this in here. And this is going to attach to this right here. All right. And before I do anything else, I'm going to go into each of these and go ship, load, always allow. And we're going to go into the vertically bit, ship, load, always allow. Then into the main part, ship, uh, load. Always allow fact check. Alright. So in the main, I've always want to always allow fact check. Well, 
chip uh, load. Well, right now we're always going to do always allow for right now. I'll have to do settle it later. All right. So I hit this button, and we need some actual cargo. Cargo space. I want the cargo container to be on the deck or on the bridge. So you are going to tie to you, except I can't tie it to it. It needs to tie its. Yeah, I need to go C on the rail, V on the cargo. All right. And let's add some cargo spaces. These are not permanent cargo spaces, these are temporary testing cargo spaces. So I'm moving these. I might not. I don't know. 1.3,000. Right, we want to change the auto pull to add all. I'm going to do it, mm, let's do it a thousand at a time. And zero so it's unlimited pull. Alright. Now you. Uh, no, you. There we go. I need a cargo block. And it needs some of these. And let's see how much is that? That's a thousand. I want to auto pull. Add all. Uh, one thousand. Zero for unlimited. And let's add a few more cargo blocks. So there, two point four. So I can pull things that are two thousand uh, rail. All right. Let's see here. And I would like a um, a wireless. The wireless is going to control. Uh, where is it? Come on. Is it going to control this rail right there? And it is going to be. Uh, unload rail. It needs to be facing this way. All right, and the cargo or the cargo block go cargo to. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Where is it? This to the cargo block. There we go. All right. So now, if I go to the Oh, oh, yeah, nope, nope, yep, I got that, alright. So, where's the cargo for you? Alright, so you are going to be attached, I don't know if you have to do this, but it's what I'm going to do. Uh, let's pull out of creative, and let's throw some of these in here. And let's see if it actually starts ticking. It's not going to, primarily, because I did not actually activate this block. And there we go. And they're all gone. And see the this pull tick, these should be gone now. Uh, they are not. Are you set not set to pull? You're set to pull. Are you set to pull on the right block? Yeah, you're set to pull on the right one. And you are a unload. And here, did I connect? There we go. I had to connect. I, well, I don't know. I have to connect that. Where am I now? All right. I am here now. Yes, apparently you do have to connect the, uh, the rail docks to everything. So we turn that off. I actually turn that on, don't we? Alright. So, let's see. Uh, let's hit uh, da, 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 creative mode again. So, I want this to be an and. There we go. Yeah, alright. The and 
and a knot. And the knot is going to control It's, the knot's gonna can control anything, is it? Yeah. All right. Now, I also need this to control a wireless. I tell you what. Let's do this as an activation module. Are you doing it as an activation module? So, um, so I don't have to worry about the buttons doing weird things. If I use a button, it'll and a flip flop, it, it'll make sure it's triggered properly. Anyway, uh, I also would like to do a wireless that's also controlled by this. And let's go here, let's grab the wireless. See on this wireless, and let's jump to the head and V on this wireless. So let's make sure that's all working. Jump, 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 jump. All right, let's see. Yep, it is now throwing that block. And let's see here. Uh, what else do we need to do? We need to do another wireless. So let's hop back into the here and we're going to do another wireless here but I don't have a wireless set up for you yet do I oh wait a minute why do I need a second wireless I only have two pull all right never mind scratch that wireless all right so if it's loading or unloading here we go Now, how am I going to do this? No, I'm going to save this for some sometime later. All right, so I'm not loading. In fact, when I hit reset or return, I wonder if I should have it just load or uh, yeah, just uh, unload. Okay. That turn everything. Yeah, that turned everything back. No, it didn't. Let's click these a couple times. All right. So that should have set everything back. And let's save this as a zero arc. Eight. There we go. And let's go hunting for an asteroid. Make sure this works. Warp in. Come on, why are the asteroids 10 bajillion miles away? And I have no thrust because I took it off. Because I'm an idiot. Thrust, thrust, thrust. Uh, 4, 5, 3, 4, 5, 3, 4, 5. Yeah, alright. Is that the nearest one? Yeah, that's friend of this. This is the closest one, even those even though those are closer. And so we need to get close to this. We're gonna mine it just for a few seconds. And then return the head and make sure everything unloads right. In fact, let's come here and let's pick those back. Or five clicks out. No, now we're five clicks out. Moving at a whopping 147.7 meters per second. Which in real life is probably fairly quick. That's what, like 30 feet a second? Something like that? I know it's not 30 feet a second. It's okay, you don't have to leave an angry comment. Um, the rock I was looking at is distinctly not there. Okay. 
It has zero blocks total. Awesome. <laughs> Are you? What about you? Uh, you're a thousand meters out, but eh, that's fine. That's well within my range. So what are we going to do? We are going to turn on the drill head. I already want that off. Turn on the drill head. Why is the drill head not turning on? Why am I moving? Okay. Something wasn't right. The, the drill was not connected right. All right. So let's go this way. Or eating the asteroid. We're eating an asteroid. Yay. Life is good. All right. Life is good. And I'll return the head. Turn the drill off. Drill is off. We have, eh, we have a handful of cargo. And, in fact, let's tell it, once you return, unload. Yep, and it's very slowly making its way, which is fine. I want it to, I want this to move very slowly this way. And it's going to connect any day now. Any day now. Come on. And it's going to go for chunk. And in the next tick. Oh, oh, we've already got it. All right. Oh, and that works. Awesome. All right. So we now have a functioning miner. I just need to wire up the logic a little more prettily, prettily and... The, well, then now we need to work on the drill head, try to make it efficient, or the more efficient than. Which, how much does it? How much does it cost to run it? Uh, forty. Yeah, it costs thirty-two thousand energy per second to run to the drill head. But now it doesn't cost anything. Huh, that's weird. All right. I have been JW608, this has been Star Made, and I'll do you cats later.